Hey guys, remember the last video? Well, that I well I posted a few minutes ago. Well, <coughs> here's this video: my top five favorite books. So let's get started. <laughs> Number one. So my favourite book, my most favourite book, is this lovely book, Matilda, by a famous author called Roald Dahl. If you don't know who he is, he writes the best stories. He's my favourite author and I'm going to read you the blurb. We saw Miss Trunchbull grab a girl by the pigtails and throw over the playground fence. So that's Miss Trunchbull and that's the girl and Matilda loves reading books and is a really talented girl. Number two, my second favourite book is Gangster Granny by David Walliams. He is also a very famous author and he makes fabulous books with real and they are so funny. Let's read you the blurb. Meet Ben's granny. She's very much your textbook granny. Don't know what that means. She has white hair. She has false teeth. She has used tissues. She has used tissues to up her sleeve. And she's an international jewel thief. So like I said, this is a really good book. Number three. So my third favourite book is Dover Wimpy Kid The Getaway. It's so funny and it's a really good book. The moral is, Greg Heffley and his family are getting out of town. With the cold weather and the stress of approaching holiday season, the Heffleys decide to escape to a tropical island resort for some much needed rest and relaxation. A few days in paradise should do wonders of Greg and his frazzled family. But the Hefleys soon discover that paradise isn't everything. It's cracked to be. Sun poisoning, stomach troubles and venomous creep critters all threaten to ruin the family ho family's holiday. Can their trip be saved or will this island getaway end in a disaster? So like I said, great book. Number four. So my fourth favourite book is George's Marvelous Medicine by Roald Dahl, as you can see. And it's a really good book about this boy called George and his grandma. The blurb is, the rule would be this. Whatever he saw, if it was runny or powdery or gooey, it went in. So yes, this is a good book too. And number five. And last but not least, my fifth favourite book is Roald Dahl's book, The Twits. It's a really funny book and I totally recommend it. The moral is, to pay Mrs Twit back for the worms in his spaghetti, Mr Twit thought up a really clever, nasty trick. So like I said, this is a really good book. So if you guys haven't read any of these books, I totally recommend reading them. They are all really good books and I love them all. And all of these other books are good as well. So thank you guys for watching this video. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it. And subscribe to my channel to become part of the Hashtag Battle Squad. Bye!